Welcome everyone, bienvenidos a Miami. Wow, okay. Here we are at the JW Marriott Marquis in downtown Miami. I am on the 31st floor of this beautiful hotel. Uh, and I'm on a corner, I'm also on a corner unit. I have no idea what I did to deserve such a fantastic room and view, but this is quite impressive. Um, first, let's start with the hallway. So, in the hallway, uh, I like the peacefulness of the white walls. The carpet is not a good carpet color because it dirties up really quickly, but I love white walls. I, you know, when you're traveling, you just want to come into a place and just feel relaxed. And I just love good old fashioned Sherwin Williams ceiling paint. Here we have the entry to this room, great floors. We have a closet with a safe and an ironing board. Oh, the furnishings here are gonna be fantastic. You're gonna be quite impressed. There is, there was a robe here that's somewhere else in the room. I have no idea where it is. Uh, oh, look at this room! I don't even know where to begin. It is a corner unit. It's incredibly impressive, wow. All right, so let's start with the TV. The TV is massive. I can't remember the last time I turned on a TV in a hotel room. It has to be at least two years. But it's nice to look at. It's nice and thin, uh, even though it will get absolutely no use. Um, I love the, 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 the wood style in this room. It's very smooth. Uh, it's almost, it almost has like a lacquered finish. Uh, very modern, very, very Miami but it's almost like a grown-up Miami. This desk is incredible. It curves, it curves. It is such an executive desk. Um, beautiful, beautiful. And it connects with the TV, uh, our, the, inner, the TV entertainment room, or entertainment admirer, which is fantastic. There's a computer. I have no idea what I'm gonna use or what I'm gonna use this computer for, but there's a computer. Um, I did turn it on and I couldn't figure it out, but who has a computer in their room? I mean, what are you gonna do with it? Maybe someone is dying to use a desktop. I can see, I can see why you want, why want a computer in your room. And there's a TV system. Uh, I was looking for the stationery and I couldn't find it. And it's like nicely hidden in here, which is great. I love it. I might just take that home. Uh, nice chair and desk. More views, oh my god, okay. This, as you can see, Miami Beach is way down there. This is Brico Key. Right in the center of your screen is the beautiful Mandarin Oriental Hotel. Now that is an incredible property. If you're ever looking to go to a top-notch spa in Miami, go there. My yacht is down there waiting for me. I told them I have a 6.30 yoga class, so. I need to be down there pretty cool, pretty soon so they can take me to my class. Uh, sitting area, the bed is beautiful. One of the things that I love whenever I stay at a, J, at a JW, which is actually not very often, it's not very often that I stay at nice hotels like this. Uh, but when I do stay at a JW, is that this is the bed I have at home. So it's, it's very nice to come to go to a hotel and stay in the same exact bed that uh, you sleep in at home. So that's... Oh, that's refreshing. Uh, nice desk. Nice. I mean, look at this. Look at the ceilings. Can we talk about the ceiling height in this hotel room? It is 20, 20 foot ceilings. Wow. Nice headboard, reading lights. Um, oh, one of the things that I struggled at, uh, struggled with when I came to this hotel room is that the, I couldn't figure out how to shut and open the blinds that were stuck. Uh, so I thought they were automatic and I looked all around the room for an automatic like an automatic button to open and close the, br the blinds. I couldn't find it and then later on I realized that there is a, where is it? On the other side there is a cord, a good old fashioned old cord to open and close the blinds. Uh, so I was disappointed by that. Okay, let's talk about the minibar. If there was ever any moment where I wanted to steal something from a hotel room, this is that moment. There is an Illy Espresso machine in this room, okay? 
First of all, how many times have you seen an Ely coffee house in the U.S.? Very few times. And to have your own Ely coffee maker in your room is just above and beyond. And on top of that, they give you little biscottis to drink your, your coffee with. And then they give you like all these categories of, well, I'm not really sure what the colors are for, but it's just too cute. Too cute. Uh, the spoons are flat. See? flat spoons and nice little European style coffee cups love it uh, here down here we have our mini bar uh, oh my god okay so years ago I went to Paris and I ordered water of the Badois and I thought that that was that meant tap water apparently I learned very extensively that it does not mean tap water it means the brand Badois and that was probably one of the most expensive bottles of water that I ever ordered in a restaurant. Now I know that that Badois is a brand of water in France. And here we have it in this hotel room. Uh, wine, wine bottle, extra cu cups of ice, uh, cups of water down there, and then this mini bars, which you want to be terribly afraid of because I think these are the ones where if you touch something, it charges you for it. So you want to make sure that you don't touch it it is one of those mini bars or unless you're ready to pay and charge for it also miss maria the housekeeper was so nice that when i come home after an exhausting day of working she has my eyes out here or she has eyes out here for me with like a cup of water which is just incredibly thoughtful incredibly thoughtful this hotel, you know, to be a four-star hotel, this place has done it right. I mean, this is above and beyond from what I was expecting. Oh, you know what? Um, the lights don't work if my key is not plugged in here. Oh, while well, we're here, we also have this system where we can call to make up the room, and we also can put the Do Not Disturb sign on, and then we can also turn on all, turn on and off all the hotel room lights. Nice full-length mirror, great. Miami Sun in the rug. Moving over to the bathroom. Uh, towels, a weight scale. You don't want to ever weigh yourself in a weight scale. It's never good. Um, and here's the bathroom. Well, guess what we have in the bathroom? A TV in the mirror. How many times have you seen a TV in the mirror? I've only seen it twice, I think. Here and in the San Regis in Mexico City. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I never watch TV or the news, uh, but this is just nice thing to look at uh there's a tub with a rack of amenities uh over it there's a nice shower and then the toilet of course and then the sink i love the marble i think this would be a nice marble for a kitchen uh if it's done right beautiful beautiful finishes and then there's a little stool right here which you can pull it out and then sit on it when you get tired of brushing your teeth. Oh my God. Okay. All right, I think that's the tour of the room. Till next time, bye Felicia.